guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today I have created this dramatic look for any of you who are daring enough to look like this for prom. I know there are quite a few individuals who feel very intimidated by such dramatic looks, but trust me, you will slay the day. So this look, we will be doing a smoky eye with um, glitter, as you can see, and dramatic lashes, and um, yeah. Um, I'm also going to be creating a second video um, connecting with this one, and the second video is going to be my soft glam look, but um, this is going to be the dramatic one. If you want to see how I created this look, then keep on watching. I've already done this eye, and we're gonna start with the other. So, and I've already done my face makeup and my eyebrows. I'm gonna use a orange shadow, and this is going to be our transition. So, we're just gonna put that all over our eye. It doesn't really matter, because um, the end result, we're just gonna put black in the center anyway, so gonna take your orange color, spread it from your inner eye corner and your outer corner and we're just gonna blend it back and forth and um, with your brush again uh, we're gonna extend that color up and blend it out and do the same thing with the inner eye corner now to intensify the color even more, I'm going to take um, a brighter shade, I'm going to take another color that's more pigmented, and I'm going to do the exact same. Um, so now we are going to go into a dark brown, so whatever dark brown you have, um, we're gonna take down the outer edge. Something about you makes me feel alive. The only one so after placing your brown in, we're gonna go in with a black shadow. And we're gonna put that all over our eyelid so it can be a base for our glitter. Something about you. Something about you. We're gonna take um, the orange and the brown again and we're gonna blend that together. The glitter I'll be using is the BH Cosmetic Glitter Collection in the shade Warm Espresso. And then I'll be using the NYX glitter primer. So what you want to do is you want to use a flat brush and you want to take your glitter primer and you want to put it all over your lid like how you did with your black eyeshadow. And then you're going to take like a small brush um, and this is going to be the glitter brush where you're going to pick up the glitter and pat it on your lid. Something you might, might want to consider doing is to put powder under your eyes so the glitter doesn't catch on your face makeup. So um, I didn't even realize it, but my camera died. So I had already placed my glitter on and you guys didn't see that. But So I had put the powder under my eye to catch the glitter. And then I had already put the primer on, and then um, right on top of that I used a small brush and just patted the glitter on and just brushed off the excess um, powder. So, sorry you missed that step. So then the next step that I would do is I would put continue the eyeshadow onto my lower, um, hot, your lower lash, I guess. So I'm gonna take the orange shade that I used and we're just gonna bring that down. And we're just gonna continue with the dark browns and then the black. Cry shine you, crash on you, cry 
crush on you, crush on you, baby girl. I'm be taking a black pencil eyeliner, and we're just gonna tight line and um, waterline our eyes. So the next step is to put on lashes. Now I got these lashes from my cousin, and um, I lose track of what brand these lashes are from. So um, just any big volume like false lashes would work. Um, these are pretty dramatic, so they'll enhance the look. Usually how I put lashes on is I start in the middle and then my inner corner and then the um, outer corner piece. I might have to fix that off camera. So then I'm gonna take a highlighter or a highlight color and we're gonna highlight our inner eye corners and our brow bone. Next, I'll be taking a um, eyebrow gel and we're gonna brush our eyebrows. This will keep them in place and also give us color in our brows. Just like that. And you can also proceed to put on mascara for your bottom lashes. So now we're done with the eyeshadow. We are going to finish off with our face. So then I'm going to contour my face using the Y Collection um, Matte Bronzer in the shade Caramello or Caramello. I don't know. But we're just going to take that and we're going to bronze our face. And I have my mirror right here because that's where I'm looking. So we're just going to go down our cheekbones and then our um, chin. And if you're looking for a dramatic look, you really want to go all out. So sharp cheekbones, really deep contour, but not too much where it looks um, really weird. So then after that's done, I'm going to take a little loose powder and I'm just going to go down my cheeks to emphasize our cheekbones. Just like that. And while that's baking, we are going to contour our nose. So I just have this little brush right here and just make two vertical lines down my nose. And I usually connect it up to my eyes like that. And after getting that down, I just rub it in. And it also gives away the rough lines. So after this done, I just brush it off. I usually just wait a couple minutes, maybe just a minute or 30 seconds. And now it's time for blush. I use the Shina B blush in Delany. It's just a pink blush. And we're gonna go with our apples. to slightly brush it over my nose and now since we've got blush done next is my favorite part which is highlighting so what I like to do beforehand is I like to spray my face either with like what are those like setting sprays fine or um, the Mac I don't even know what it's called anymore well the Mac spray that makes your face look really dewy that would work too so I'm gonna get my setting spray and just spray my face and then I'm going to take my highlighting brush and I'm going to take my Ofra highlighter that is by Nikki Tutorials. I'm just going to take that on our cheeks. And this is the same highlighter that we used for our inner eye corner and our eyebrows. So I take it on my cheek and then I bring it up and I lightly drag it over here and then um, take the brush and just brush it down my nose and over my lip. And in most cases, um, this glow would be too subtle for me. So I would add another um, highlighter on top. So to add on top of this, I'm going to use the Wet n Wild um, highlighting powder in Precious Petals. And we're just going to push it lightly just to add some more. 
and next are the lips. So for lips, you could literally do anything, whatever you want, but um, in this case, since my eyes are the show of my face, um, I'm just gonna put on a lip gloss, a shimmery lip gloss. This is called Beauty For Real. It's in the shade Sunlight. It's just a shimmery lip gloss that will enhance the look but won't distract from your eyes. You can even put a lip liner under the lip gloss if you want, but with a look like this, um, you don't want anything to distract from the eyes. So this is the finished look, and you can obviously see that I changed my hair to make it look like a low bun, because that is what I would have done if I went to prom. So a casual messy bun, <laughs> just to give the idea and hope. <laughs> um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and give a like and a comment down below, and also subscribe to my channel for more and stay tuned for the next video which is going to be the second part of this video which is the soft glam look so yeah